Hello everybody, DJ Vic Vapor with you, back with another Logic Pro 10 beginner's course. In this lesson, I'm going to talk a little bit about time signatures and how to set that. And um, let's take a look. So, let me see, Command N. It's going to open up a new project. I don't want to close this one. And you're going to get this screen right here. So I've got new project selected, empty project, and I'm not going to actually choose and open it. But what I wanted to show you is, before you open a new project, how to set the key and the time signature and, and things like that. So you want to go ahead and open this disclosure arrow here under details. And now you've got your information available. You can set major key, minor key, can select whatever key you like and here you can set your time signature four four three four you know whatever you want to set it as you can set your tempo and grid and things like that so I'm gonna cancel this and another way to view that is over here under our global area I'm gonna hit G and you've got the signature lane right here Typically, it's a little bit more narrow, so you might see it displayed as 4-4 four, four in the key of C, or whatever you've got set. But if you actually drag it and make it a little bit taller, they'll line up underneath each other here. And you can actually make multiple sets, so you can have different time signatures and different keys throughout the project by creating new sets. So there you have it just a little bit more detailed information about setting up the time signature and the key for your projects thanks for watching hope you're enjoying everything and we'll talk to you in the next tutorial peace